relationships can be tough especially when one of the parties involved is not of this world. Earlier this year, Amanda Tiag, a 45-year-old Jack Sparrow impersonator from Northern Ireland, wed a 300-year-old pirate ghost named Jack, but it seems like their unlikely union has come to an end. So I feel it's time to let everyone know that my marriage is over, the mother of five wrote. According to the Irish Mirror, I will explain all in due course but for now all I want to say is be very careful when dabbling in spirituality, it's not something to mess with. The couple wed in a private ceremony on a boat in the international waters off of Ireland, where the marriage would be legal. Tiag hired a medium for the ceremony, so Jack could say, I do, making the union official on paper and since Jack couldn't put on a ring, Tiag held a candle that the ring was placed on which symbolized Jack. Tiag previously told people that their love story began in 2014, after the ghost of a Haitian man visited her while she was lying in bed. She soon learned that he was Jack, an 18th century pirate who had been left at the altar once before and was ultimately executed for thievery. As she interacted with the entity over the course of several months, Tiag claimed she began to develop feelings for it. This was about six months of communication so I finally accepted it. Obviously we had spent a lot of time together, Tiag, who was previously married for six years, told People. I was horrified to discover I had romantic feelings for him, having never heard of that before. Eventually, Tiag said the two even started having a sexual relationship but she wanted more. Growing up in Ireland in my era, you were taught that if a man bedded you, he should wed you, she said. I knew from my research that spiritual marriage was a thing so it was more me that wanted to get married than him he would have been happy like most men with just sex. She went on to tell people that although the public response to her marriage hasn't always been positive, she thinks it's important to speak out about being involved in unconventional relationships. I hope by me coming out, it will encourage others to not feel alone or afraid, she explained. It's not all like the entities in other horror films, there are loving caring spirits out there too, you just need to know what you're doing.